And here we are today in Primrose Hill having an interview about the difference between spiritual church and the mental health world sedation control echoing into COVID. So if we look at the psychologists from 1880 through to today, there is a misogyny and a oppression that the drugs you're given will stop you trying to hear voices or have visions. Now here we are in Primrose Hill, famous artistic ancient hill for artists, musicians, therapists internationally, back to the Druids who obviously wanted to hear voices and see their ancestors and have visions and make films and movies. So the key here, how do some people end up in mental health but are also going to the international spiritual churches, tribal gatherings, music festivals or art clubs or coffee shops. The key here is who is disabled and do you have to have a mental health check to get a disability allowance? Number one, if you're psychotic, you hear voices that tell you to do terrible things these obviously are not good spirits, they're from the underworld. If you go to a spiritual healer, they will guide you to open up and lock down through yoga, tai chi, mindfulness, meditation and healing so that you then shut down the negative voices, you moderate your drinking, preferably stay off the drugs, and then you can utilize your visual mind and empathic mind to communicate as did the Celts, Saxons, American Indians, the Aboriginal people. To be guided by your ancestors. Being guided by your ancestors, your spirit guides, your angels, your fairies, your traditional elders, your poets, your musicians, you're spiritually guided. Being spiritually guided is not being in a psychotic state or mental health. And this is where in the last 50 years there's been a confusion of information. So if you studied the history of psychiatry, psychology, cognitive therapy, it's a rational, literal thing. So in my lecture, is this enlightenment or is this madness? The key to either is that boring intellectualists were jealous of passionate people that danced, were artists, dreamt, right back to the colonial Christians, the witch hunting medieval vicars, and today the psychiatrists and the psychologists that say you're delirious, therefore it isn't true. Therefore, safe therapy is where you can handle the information you're given and you're not upsetting anyone in your community. So the key to this is, are straight people jealous of artists, musicians, therapists, holistic traditionalists who dream and perceive? So in the redesigned centre here in Primrose Hill, Camden, the echo with Amy Winehouse, David Bowie, George Michael, in reflection to 
open mic poetry and would they echo to the modern day poets? These discussions should be had because a lot of creative people going to the wrong analyst are then sent to draconian therapy and still sent into these sedation hospitals where they're not given the guidance to handle correct historical information where you can be calm and holistic and have harmony with the mind, body and spirit where you find peace and harmony through yoga, walking and mindfulness and you can open up or down to see your fairies, angels and ancestors. You do not open up the underworld to hear grungy voices that tell you to do ridiculous, silly things. Where you could harm yourself or other people. Safe therapy. This will be rediscussed. further on. This is MC Purple discussing is this madness and enlightenment and where can we be safely spiritual, enlightened and in tune with our Celtic, Saxon spiritual after working five years in the markets and um, butterfly tarot, I learned many things meeting pilgrims, travellers Astrologers, palmists, tarot readers, soothsayers, dreamers, pilgrims on the history of their spiritual journeys to be creative. Therefore, is a creative artist allowed to be wild enough to perform, paint, sing, dance? and should not be allowed to be put through draconianism where the status quo are bored or jealous of their eccentricity. Therefore, anybody having visions or dreams should write a diary, see themselves as an eccentric, and really stay away from the mental health sedation which says you can't hear or see these things as in having visions and hearing voices care groups around the planet linked to mental psychology hospitals that shut down what you're perceiving Going to the Psychic College in Kensington, Psychic Association, Spiritual Church Movement, and all the multi faith Asian Buddhist, Tibetan Buddhist mindfulness, yogas, Tai Chi's from China, the Celtic dancing. You find a way of harmonizing the mind, body, and the spirit. Good luck with your journey, good luck with your healing, good luck with balancing your mind, body and spirit holistically in holistic London from Primrose Hill, May 2022. Thank you. In reflection to Adam Ant, who is Stuart Goddard or the Oasis guys or any of the great poets, they all had moments where the general probably, probably couldn't comprehend. At this point, it's better to go on a holiday or a safe retreat, eat well, stay away from pharmaceutical drugs. Thank you all.